Okay, so the design that we are gonna be doing, which is Color Temptations, um, I have over here some examples of different combinations of colors. As you see, they're very, very aggressive color, very aggressive combinations. And um, what I want you to see over here is that they all have different applications of products. Like for example, in this nail over here, we have on the color temptations dusted with the prisma powders but we also have it dusted with the dazzle rocks glitters so it doesn't matter which one do you choose the technique is going to be the same Okay, so now that it's completely dry, I'm gonna do a second application. And the reason why I wanna do a second application when I'm doing um, dustings is because in case that it wears out, I want to be sure that the color that I intended to have is still there. So I'm gonna follow the shape that I previously did with the polish. And now I'm going to dust it with the pink neon plush. And, and this is like, it's like a sand, but it's not a sand, but it has that texture. It's going to give me texture on the nail. And I'm going to sprinkle it completely, take the excess of it, and be sure that you cover every angle of the nail. You're going to cure. If you're using UV, you're gonna cure for two minutes, but if you're using LED, it's going to be one minute. Okay, now that it's completely cured, I'm gonna make a mix using my gel art paint white. I'm gonna use isopropyl alcohol, and of course, our clinic is made of isopropyl alcohol. So I'm gonna use um, clinic, and I'm also going to be using manic mat. And the manic mat, it is a matte top coat for our lacquer polishes. So I'm gonna use a drop of this. So here we are. The first thing that I'm gonna do for this mix is using my gel brush and I'm going to bring it into the alcohol, the clean it, okay? Then I'm going to take a small amount of the white, about that much, I'm gonna put it in my tile and I'm going to take one drop of my Manic Matte Lacquer and I'm gonna mix. Okay, why are we doing this? Is because when we use the alcohol inside of our gel art paint, it's gonna give us a different viscosity on a mix. It's going to, little by little, it's going to evaporate leaving a sticky mixture that is going to be perfect for my nail design. So as you see, it is not as thick as it was before from the jar and it starts to get right there a little bit 
drier and drier. And why do we put the lacquer? Is to give us the consistency that I need in order for me to create this design. Okay, now it's almost there. Perfect. So I'm gonna use my gel brush. I'm gonna take the excess completely out. And now I'm going to create whatever design you wanna create over here. I'm gonna make like a flower. taking my dotting tool and I'm going to mark the center of my flower. You can use either one of the sides, whether it is the, the heavy one or the smaller one, depending what is the design that you are creating. So as you see, I'm just scratching the surface and I can see that because of the mixture that I did. And I'm gonna create some wiggle lines inside of my center. Now I'm going to do the same thing with each one of the petals. <laughs> 